rain's on the move. So let's get right to where the showers are at now and where this first batch is heading first. You can see on our more local view here in the tri-state that no rain is here as of yet. Yeah, maybe a sprinkle out there, but let's zoom out. We have this larger shield of rain heading down near I-69. Now that's going to continue down toward Louisville, almost missing us. We have this other uh, segment of storms more north of I-70, but that's heading due east. What I'm watching though, these little isolated showers just starting to pop out there near I-65, um, just kind of southwest of Indianapolis. That's the line trying to fill in, and that's why we'll end up seeing some showers here over the next three hours, but nothing severe or overly organized. It's 70 degrees right now in Middletown, 64 in Hillsborough, 74 in Union. It is considerably warmer out there this morning. So by lunchtime, we'll be at 77 degrees. We top out at 80. Temperature really not the story today. It's all about that rain timing. So let's just dive right into that. From now, as we go to about 7 a.m., Shower chances will be out there. Southeast Indiana, you're really the ones that will see the better chance for rain, if anyone, this morning. And even coming into a little bit of uh, Hamilton County and down through northern Kentucky. But, I mean, it's it's spotty and it's not all that organized. But we will have to monitor some downpours. So that's why I'm going to continue to watch. Just keep checking in if you're not leaving anytime soon. Through 9 a.m., still those isolated showers. Now at lunch, after that point, our chance for rain is really starting to pick up through the afternoon. This shows 4 p.m. Scattered showers and thunderstorms are out there. Keep in mind, this is just a weather model trying to depict the weather scenario later today. What this shows you and me as well is that everyone has a chance for scattered showers and thunderstorms this afternoon, well through this evening with those isolated downpours possible. Good news, if anything, though, the severe weather threat has actually been dropped down for us today. Cloud cover is going to limit how much energy we can even build. A lot of marginal risk area over the Ohio Valley, but if we were to see anything, it'd be a higher wind gust, no tornado threat today, or even the chance for large hail. 68 tonight, showers will continue tomorrow, high of 80, and we're still going to see some of these little spotty showers popping up tomorrow afternoon. It's not enough to cancel outdoor plans, but you will potentially see some of that rain passing by, but ending in the evening and we're still good to go for the weekend. So Jacqueline, we're watching out for wet pavement eventually, but right now the roads are high and dry.